Well, everyone, Joel 2 is here again. Got another great video for you. Got the radar gun back out. Everybody keeps asking about that radar, so I brought it back out. And we're going to try to get some CSX trains and maybe a Norfolk Southern train if we're lucky. These lines for Norfolk Southern aren't very busy. Got a couple tracks here for Norfolk Southern. We've got CSX running through the area also. Let's go ahead and start the video, son, and let's see what we can do. Here we go. We're up near Carlisle, Ohio. Okay, I got a train coming. It's got a little bit over 200 axles. I forgot the exact number, 212 or 224, something like that. So probably, what, about 50 cars or so. Here she comes, around the curve, CSX. Hope it's a good one. We're going to do a speed check on it. Auto racks. Okay, so that one was going about 48 when it first got here and it slowed down a little bit once it started going around that curve. They're heading into Carlisle. For some reason, whenever they get near Carlisle, they always slow down. I've noticed that. That was pretty neat though. All right, thanks for watching. That was a good one. Thanks for watching everyone. Ah, but wait, there's more, of course there always is. Got another southbound train coming on the CSX line. I'm over here eating lunch. I just heard it on my scanner. They're going to be here any second now, so let's get ready. Got the radar gun over here. We're going to see how fast this train goes. We're up here in Carlisle, Ohio.
Okay, there you go. That was booking pretty good. Going about, I think about 49 miles an hour. And then it slowed down a little bit to around, uh, what, 47, 48, something like that by the time it went by. That was pretty cool. So we got a couple crossings up here in the Carlisle area. Trains do book pretty good up here, but you know, they seem to be going faster when you don't have a radar gun. What are these dinging? Huh, that's interesting. The train just now went by and they're going back down again. I don't know if it's malfunctioning or what. Let's have a look. Okay, a little bit of malfunction there. Thanks for watching, folks. That was pretty cool. Ah, oh, but wait, there's more. Of course, so is this. Wow, that was a good one. <clears throat> they were booking. I should have checked the speed on that one. That was a good one. <clears throat> um, you notice that flat spot on that last car going by? That was pretty loud. Bang, bang, bang like that. Big flat spot. Leave a comment below about that. That was pretty neat though. Pretty awesome. All right, let's have a close look at the track right here at the railroad crossing. You got 2009 one dash that means january so this rail was rolled january of 2009 and 136 that's 136 pounds per yard so that is pretty good size rail the biggest rail that i've seen so far is 141 pounds per yard does anyone see any rail heavier than that leave a comment below Hey, got a lot for sale right here, right next to the railroad track. Check it out. There's your lot right there for sale, right next to the tracks. Okay, that was pretty cool. Got to see them backing up to Franklin Industrial Spur. They came from Carlisle, backing from Carlisle up into Franklin. And they do have to go down the middle of the road if they work the customer at the end of the spur. Two customers on the spur. The one at the very end, you have to go down the middle of the road to get to them. 
So that was pretty neat. Thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up, folks. Okay, that was pretty cool. Thanks for watching, everyone. I really appreciate it. Give me a thumbs up. If you have time, watch another video. Every view really helps my channel. And we'll see you later. Jaw tooth out.